Have you ever wondered how good the PCM audio could sound on the Sega Genesis if ROM storage wasn't an issue? No? You haven't? <laughs> well, I don't I don't blame you. I never would have thought of uh I never would have thought of that until I saw this and this is really cool. I I have to show you guys this or better yet, you have to listen to this. I've got something loaded into that ROM cartridge there. And uh well let, let me just uh let me just click play game here. You know what time it is. Yo homie, I can assure you what you're hearing is playing off a of bone stock Sega Genesis. And uh, that's, that sounds pretty good, doesn't it? <laughs> you see, this is a PCM file that's playing at 26 kilohertz. And that's a lot higher than what any of the games actually would use because of the, you know, amount of storage space this takes up. This is like a 40 second audio clip. It just keeps looping over and over again. It's, it's about 40 seconds long, though. And this 40 second long clip is taking up almost 8 megabits. 8 megabits is... I don't know, your average Genesis game, I guess? It's not the bigger Genesis games, but... 8 megabits is the size of a lot of Sega Genesis games. The whole game. <laughs> and this is just a 40 second audio clip. So you'd imagine, you know, just to fit a song, like a 2 minute song, you're gonna need like a 40 megabit... Uh, Cart, which is just insane. That's, so that's what 26 kilohertz gets you. But you know, you have to admit, it sounds pretty damn good. And you know, I just wanted to show you that because the Genesis sound hardware is, is pretty underrated, um, and it's capable of pretty amazing things. <laughs> 